pasa mi gente trabajadora andamos una vez más en Romero Lawn Service aquí vamos a aplicar veneno para la yarbilla para la yarbilla mala y ah, vamos a echar este producto We Type for Lawns esto lo echamos aquí a la yarda para el para las yarbillas también mata la hierba pero no mata el tacate y vemos a John que anda echando el químico y se le entró la flor verde alrededor de los árboles John. aquí seguimos aplicando este producto Will Stop for Long para los que ocupen para la yarbilla para esto no ocupa licencia es, esto lo puedo agarrar en sus tiendas uh, preferible su tienda más cercana para yardas jardines una vez aplicado tarda en 3 horas puede ver resultados en 24 horas se verá ya muerta la yarbilla y en 72 horas muerta por completa ahí está mi racilla ahí va quedando gente bueno para este químico no se ocupa como les digo no se ocupa a licencia porque aquí en, en Texas y me imagino que en todo el país se ocupa de licencia para bueno se ocupa de licencia y se ocupa a ir a una escuela para aplicar químicos para hierbas para controlar las hierbas pero este no se ocupa de licencia y este lo podemos echar nosotros porque este producto lo puede comprar cualquiera en en las tiendas más cercanas ferreteras aquí en la ciudad y pues es lo que estamos aplicando mi gente este lo puedo aplicar, pero que no esté menos 40 grados o más de 90 grados. Se puede aplicar. ¿Ahí quedó, no, John? Creo que quedó, pa. Ahí está. Sí, ¿Reaste bien todo allá? ¿Ya quedó todo? ¿Ahí quedó bien? Ahí quedó, ¿no? Ya, ahí quedó, digo. No está bien. Como que ya, ya quedó bien todo penetrado. Chill, you like that chill? Alright guys, we're gonna mow this gel right here. This is before. And you will guys see the after in a few minutes. Let's get it done. Where's Isaac? He's over here taking a break, eating lunch. 
Play hombre, saco que. You are hungry? Check. Hey. <laughs> I was like, man, where's Shaq the guy, man? I was mowing up over there, and then I came over here and saw him. He was eating right there, eating the donut and the Coke. Am I hiding up? Yeah, we're almost on here. We're almost on here, guys. Mowing. I better blow this street. All right, guys. So we finished mowing this one right here. We got. I just had Isaac blowing right there real quick. He's gonna blow, and then uh, we're gonna call this a video. We did a few jobs today. Today is Saturday. I've been blogging since yesterday, but uh, I didn't have time to blog a lot. So we're just gonna talk, guys. <clears throat> we're just gonna talk long here. Yeah. Uh, I got a message out yesterday from a, a, a subscriber. He was asking me, hey, uh, how do I know if I need help? How can I know if I'm making money? I mean, not making money, but uh, how do I, how, should, how can I uh, uh, hire another guy? Como puedo contratar a alguien? Cuanto sé, cuanto lo estoy ganando? Cuanto le puedo pagar? Uh, he said if you pay his helpers 150 to 140, I think, something like that, 150 or 160 a day, depends on what time they get home. So, and uh, I think he's still charging uh, $35 and $30 for yours. <coughs> and this video is to all of you guys who are might be scared, to you guys who might be scared to uh, go, uh, on your prices go higher on your prices hey guys so this is the thing guys don't be scared don't be scared to raise up your prices don't be scared to tell your clients you know what my man uh, i mean everything's going up everything's going up right now gas is going up uh, i mean everything's going up groceries is going up <clears throat> a lot of stuff's going up uh -oh. poison ivy yeah guys so don't be scared. Number one thing, don't be scared to raise up your prices. Number one, mi gente, no tengan miedo. No tengan miedo de, uh, de, de levantar sus precios. Si cobras 30, diles que ya van a ser 40 mínimo. Pero yardas de 30 yo ya no tengo. Uh, yo a todas les dije que 40 y para arriba. Porque pues el, car, el gas está muy caro. Eh, el material, el equipo sale caro. La compostura de las máquinas sale caras. Uh, yeah, guys, so I'm, I'm telling uh, you guys, like, don't be scared to raise up your prices. You might uh, lose uh, some clients, and don't worry, guys. I used to be scared, too. Not no more, guys. I raised up my, my prices, and, yeah, I, I lost a few loans, but, I mean, I mean, uh, I don't mind losing clients. Either, I mean, because loan, that's a... Uh, in Spanish, we, tell, we say it, it's, it's un lujo. Cortar la yarda es un lujo. Porque para cortar la yarda es un lujo. Porque todos pueden cortar su yarda. I mean, anyone can mow their own yard. <coughs> but uh, you, you want something nice, you want something beautiful, you're going to pay somebody to do it. You don't want to do it. You don't want to be out here in the heat. If you don't want to be out in the heat, you're going to pay somebody. You know what I mean? So, people... Sometimes people are cheap, they want to pay $30 and that's it to mow a yard. 
so people are smart. I mean, people they're not gonna say, oh here, here a uh, uh, ten dollars extra. They don't. They don't even give you tips sometimes. People are always giving tips to barber shops. People are always giving tips to uh, waitress. People are always giving tips to all these kind of uh, workers, but they they hardly give tips to long guys. So you know what I mean. So they don't want to give tips. So raise up the price. You gotta raise up the price, guys, because this machine is not cheap to fix. I paid two hundred and eighty dollars last time to get it fixed. And a BK right now. You don't, you don't see BK. Uh, she's at the shop, and she's not gonna be cheap to get it back. She's gonna be like uh, 581. You know what I mean? Not, not nothing is cheap over here. You gotta pay for your stuff. You gotta pay for your gas. You gotta you you uh, if your truck breaks down. You gotta pay for your truck, and it's not cheap to, to fix the truck. You know what I mean, guys? So you need to raise up your prices. And don't be scared. I used to be scared, guys. Yo tenía miedo cuando trabajaba para la compañía. No, no me quería salir de la compañía porque yo ganaba mucho, no ganaba mucho dinero, pero ganaba bien y tenía un cheque seguro por semana. I used to work for the company, guys, and I used to be scared to quit and can't do long here because you know why? Because I was like, you know what? I have a weekly check. I don't worry. I don't have to worry about nothing else. Just come, show up, work, and I'ma have a weekly. I'ma have a weekly check. And then I was like, you know what? They, they, uh, I, I said, you know what? Forget this, man. I'm gonna start doing long care full time, and that's it. But don't be scared. So yeah, guys. So I started doing long care full time. Perdí el miedo. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna lose the fear. Start my long care business. And here I am, guys. Been blessed. I'm fixing my trailer right now. Fixing it right now. I mean, you know what I mean? I'm doing all this kind of stuff to my trailer because I'm not charging cheap. I used to charge cheap, guys. Don't believe, don't get me wrong, I used to charge cheap. And a lot of you guys from YouTube, a lot of you guys were like, man, you're charging too cheap, man. You need to go up on the prices. And you know what? Yeah, I went up on my prices, so. You need to go up on your prices, my friend. Suban los precios y va a salir para pagar a la gente. Y you, you, you know, like, on three loans, on three $40 loans, that's enough to pay John already. So if I make 10, 12 yards a day, I'm good. 13 yards a day, three yards for John and 10 yards for me. You know what I mean? With three yards, I pay John and then the rest are mine. You know what I mean? So we need to raise up the prices. Raise up your prices. Don't be scared. Shout out to my friend that uh, sent me an Instagram, a message on Instagram. If you guys wanna message me on Instagram, I'm gonna let my Instagram uh, down, down below. You can text me and let me know. Ask me anything you wanna ask me. I mean, I'm not Mr. Know at all, but uh, I can give you something to, I can, I, can, I can give you a little tip. Pero depende de usted, raza, depende de usted que pierda el miedo de cobrar. No tenga miedo de cobrar. Cobre lo que es, cobre lo justo. Cobre lo justo. Just charge whatever it is. I mean, don't, don't charge more than what it is. No más cobren, no más lo que es. No más, no más lo que es y ya. So yeah, guys, I'm gonna let you guys go. <coughs> Thank you very much for watching this video. Ánimo, raza. Ahí anda el Isaac. Ahí anda el Isaac, güey, Déjenle. Le voy a ayudar. <coughs>